Hello, and welcome to How to Organize Trends in Power Monitoring Expert. This video is not designed to convey how to create trends. So as you can see on the screen, we already have several trends created. With a large system, it can become cumbersome on selecting multiple trends that you would like to see in unison. Within the trend web app, there is no way to add folder structures so that multiple trends for one building or one quantity across multiple sites can be quickly found or selected. The purpose of this video is to demonstrate how to organize certain trends so that multiple trends can be selected with a single click in the app. Within this video, we want to group power per phase and power total for each building. First, we need to make note of each trend and their unique URL or address that we would like to group together. So we will right click on the respective trends and select open in new window. In this demonstration, I'm using Notepad to collect my separate URLs. Next, we are going to go to the Dashboards app. Click Add Dashboard. In the bottom right, give the dashboard a name relative to the trend grouping that you're creating. Building A Power Trends, in my example. Then click Add Gadget. Select Web on the left, Web Viewer on the right. Click Next. Once again, give a name relevant to the singular trend that we are going to add to this. Click Next. In your previously noted URL in the source field and leave all of the other fields set to default. Make sure to leave the refresh interval set to none so that your trend report doesn't continually start over. This refresh interval reloads the trend page every time it refreshes. Let's repeat the gadget steps for the remaining trends in building A in this example. Note that you can adjust the size of the gadget by clicking on the lower right corner and dragging. Once you have added all trends for this group, click Finish to save the dashboard. Repeat all of the previous process to group the rest of your trends as dashboards. Once you have all of your trends grouped in dashboards, you can very easily switch between the different groups just by clicking on the respective dashboards. 
If you would like to further organize, the dashboards can be placed in a folder structured hierarchy by pressing the folder icon in the top right. Thank you for your time. Thank you.